think probably the first thing is in our area we're in a college town, so we've got students who are at the university and graduate school who are now having coverage that didn't. We're getting patients who are getting coverage that were excluded because of pre-existing conditions that didn't. And a big part of it has been the expansion of the discussion, raising awareness of the problem of 30 or 40 million folks without insurance coverage. So just the fact that it's coming into fruition now has been incredible and to expanding the dialogue and built up a bunch of buzz about what's coming down the road, which I think will be helpful as we expand it in 14.